In a remote corner of the wilderness, a man's act of kindness towards a dying cub sets off a chain of events that will leave him astonished. Little does he know that his selfless rescue will reveal a shocking secret, altering the course of his life forever. A chance encounter and a life-saving discovery. In the depths of the Alaskan wilderness, a prospector named John embarked on his quest for gold along Coho Creek on the southeastern side of Alaska's Caprino Island. As he emerged from the dense forest, he was met with a sight that froze him in his tracks, a huge Alaskan timber wolf trapped in a bog. John recognized the trap as belonging to his hunter friend George, who had tragically passed away the week before. The wolf's teats were full of milk, indicating she was a nursing mother. Her pups were in grave danger, and John knew he had to act fast. Undeterred by fear, John approached the trapped wolf cautiously. She backed away, straining at the chain, frightened by his presence. John noticed she hadn't been trapped for long, and he surmised that her den was not too far away. With a brave plan in mind, he decided to search for her cubs so he could reunite the family and help them survive. A desperate attempt to gain trust. Following the wolf's tracks through the forest and up a rock-strewn slope, John finally found the den nestled at the base of an enormous spruce tree. Four tiny hungry pups greeted him at the mouth of the cave. Realizing they were starving, John knew he had to act quickly to save them. Carefully, he picked up each pup and placed them into his burlap bag, planning to bring them to their trapped mother. Upon returning to the trapped wolf, she greeted him with a high-pitched whine, seemingly aware that her pups were with him. John released the pups and they eagerly began suckling at their mother's belly. Although the pups were now fed and content, freeing the female wolf was still a challenge. She remained wary and growled whenever John tried to get too close. Understanding that he needed to gain her trust, John decided to find food for the trapped wolf to show his good intentions. He came across a deer carcass and cut off a hindquarter to feed her, hoping to demonstrate his compassion and earn her trust. Despite her reservations, the wolf sensed his kindness and accepted the food. Earning Mother's Gratitude John continued his patient approach, dividing his time between prospecting and helping the trapped wolf. Each day, he would play with her pups and feed her to build a bond of trust. Slowly, the wolf's fear began to subside, and she allowed John to get closer to her. He discovered that the trap had caught only two of her toes, offering a glimmer of hope that she might not lose her paw. Finally, after days of persistence, John's efforts paid off. He managed to touch the wolf's trapped leg without her reacting aggressively. Encouraged by her acceptance, John found the release catch and set her free. The wolf wagged her tail slightly, expressing her gratitude for the man who had saved her and her pups. The wolf family's emotional reunion. Once free, the mother wolf did something that stunned John. She began to lick his hands and fingers as a gesture of appreciation. A bond had formed between them, transcending the barriers of human and animal. John was astonished and moved by the wolf's display of affection. The wolf family reunited, and John watched as they journeyed to an alpine meadow, where a wolf pack of nine adults and four nearly full-grown pups awaited them. The emotional reunion was accompanied by a chorus of howls, a celebration of their unbreakable connection.